Hello everyone, if you are responsible for troubleshooting industrial Ethernet network problems, then a managed switch is a valuable tool. For example with a Scalance XC208, if the switch is associated with a Profinet I.O. network, then a multitude of details can be found and used within TIA portal. I always find great use in being able to not only see what device is plugged into which port, but also the fact that I can receive a granular view of network traffic from right within the TIA portal GUI. So now we aim to demonstrate what value a managed switch can add for a Profinet I.O. network, as well as some other lesser known features of TIA portal related to network troubleshooting. Once the Scalance device has been detected and added, we can work with it in two ways. One alternative here is to find the managed switch in the device catalog and drag in into the viewer as well. Network the switch with the PLC and note the association to the PLC by seeing it in the lower right corner of the switch as well as a populated Profinet I.O. bus. Download the new hardware configuration and go online with the S7 1500 PLC. In the project tree double click online and diagnostics to work with the PLC first. Expand the Profinet interface X1 which contains the Profinet IO network and view section labeled ports. Here the connected device's name such as the XC208 with port numbering, MAC address, connection medium, and many other details like port status can be easily fetched. Similarly going online with the switch we can see the same details along with a few others. A lesser used feature of the TIA portal is the built-in SNMP functionality. Going offline with the PLC and highlighting the Scalance XC208 manage switch, and then using the Go Online feature with it alone, we can fully inspect it with SNMP. SNMP is a protocol that has been a network troubleshooting staple for a while and offers three forms here. Today we will use version 2C which requires knowing the configured community string and listening port number. So as you can see SNMP is the interface type, while picking the correct PGPC interface itself will point directly to the targeted switch, press connect, and go online. Within a matter of seconds, the online and diagnostic screen of the managed switch will populate and extend the features available as compared to Profinet. The data set available now is as if you are logged into the web server of the switch itself. Despite being read only, we can use this to troubleshoot countless things. More interestingly, if you visit the section for information and log table, it is easy to see the power of this viewer and protocol. I can see things like when ports are linked up or down, along with more. Such as here you can see how much CPU or RAM is consumed, while also viewing the cabinet temperature where the switch is located. In comparison, you can see the switch in the TIA portal as read-only which helps protect changes to the switch, but will still allow engineering to view the switch's configuration. Here is a live view of being logged into the web server of the Scalance switch, placing some emphasis now on the load and save page. Here it is possible to collect the GSDML or even EDS file extension for incorporation into third-party networks. Along with this, if you were to download the MIB file, you could inspect the device using a MIB browser to construct your own SMNP logic in the PLC. Really, I'd like to inform you that there is an entire library available to communicate with switches, let alone other third-party devices, to determine information about them. I have used this library in an S7-1500 PLC to query, for example, the link status of a printer to the HMI system. This way, you may know why your reports aren't printing. Please like and subscribe if you find any of this content helpful.